welcome back to my October Daily Share for 2015. Um, I'll have a mini series showing you my October Daily and my finished album. And at the end I'll have a flip through, a final complete flip through and a reflections video. So, sort of how like I do for my December dailies. So if you guys are interested, stay tuned to finish the series. I'll have all the links posted down below for my October Daily 101 video, my October Daily process videos, and the videos for the pages before if you're tuning in now. I'll have all those videos linked in the description box and also in floating around somewhere on this video. So hope you guys check those videos out as well. And thank you for joining me if you're new to my channel. Welcome. I hope you guys enjoy. So today I want to share days 15 to, let's say, 2021. 20, we'll see how many I can get. Um, so let's just get right into it. Day 15, um, I worked at 5 a.m. I do a lot of 5 a.m. shifts where I work, and this was just a 5 a.m. selfie. I liked how my hair looked. I liked what I was wearing. So... I just took a 5 a.m. selfie before starting my shift and just making some goofy faces. Um, again, this is a pocket from Michaels and and here I just did some journaling. This is the journaling for this day and then this is the journaling for the movies and um, I talked about my favorite movies and then these are just stickers from After Dark and then I used one of my um, Jeepers Creepers 4x6 journaling cards. I just added some embellishments and ephemera from something wicked from my mind's eye um, I did forget to mention that in my previous video the collections I've used are my mind's eye something wicked ephemera and paper I use the after dark ephemera and I use the boo collection along with other papers and stuff that I have in my stash so that is what I used and if you want to see more about the products I used in my last video which will be the final flip through and the reflections video I have uh, I'll show you the different products I used in depth there. So that was day 15 and day 16 is my least favorite card of the whole album. It's super boring. At first I used my bat stencil but I did it upside down because um, I, I stenciled it on the back of this paper because it's just white. But it was upside down so I covered it up with pattern paper and then made it look like this and I made a big cluster here. Uh, this day I watched Beetlejuice and um, I want to take a picture of Beetlejuice and my Halloween tree in the background. So that's what it looks like. I use this paper that has a little green background and ghosts because he's the ghost with the most. This coffin little uh, die cut is from Sabrina Ann, so is this beetle. And um, yeah, this little like chevron glitter tape is from Michaels. And I added the Pop Fist paper stickers that we um, collaborated with. She it's it was included in my Halloween kit, but she has them for sale in her store. So um, if you guys are interested, so that is 15 and 16. Day 17 was a Saturday, and I had a lot of stuff going on that day. I was part of two YouTube hops, and then at night I went to a um, fear fest sort of Halloween event at my local um, amusement park, which is whatever. It's okay. It's not the best, but it's still fun to do. So I really love using these sort of filler cards, decorating them up, and so for this card here, I used some crepe paper that I got from from Sabrina Ann, and then just some ephemera. This is a picture, I've been t I try to take selfies with all the different monsters I saw, so I went through the, what was it called, the zombie walk, or something like that, and um, I took a picture with the zombie. They just wear masks, it's pretty cool. Um, these are like little zombie hand dies, die cuts that I got from Melanie um, in my Secret Reaper swap. Then I just added some stickers and washi tapes and stuff. So this is the title page. This is that says La Ronde, um, which is the name of the amusement park. And then I just use my bat, uh, what's it called, my bat embossing folder with the black shiny paper from Michaels. I don't know if you guys can pick that up. And I really, I'm sorry about the glare. But I am showing you pocket pages, so it's kind of natural to have glare. Um, and I'm filming by my window, so yeah, I hope you guys can see okay. A little cluster of embellishments here. And then another little zombie die cut from Melanie. And then Jeepers Creepers is from my sticker kit, from my Jeepers Creepers kit. Um, so here is the zombie walk. And I took a lot of pictures, and this one's really cool. He's like behind his camper. And then here he's like barbecuing a person and he's eating. I take a really up close picture. This is my friend and a zombie and then some of the decor. I have a lot of pictures for this day. 
The next page looks like this, still the same day, a filler card from Mambi, and then I cut this Project Life card down to size, and I just did my journaling there, and I matted it on top of the paper, the back side of this paper. I like using double-sided cardstock a lot in my album, that way I didn't have to add an extra sheet of paper and make it too bulky. So I try to take advantage of that as much as I can in this album. The next little page is for the taxidermist, which is kind of like a scare zone thing that was done outside. And we were here for the longest time. We were just watching the show. It was really cool. He um, created this um, creature lady. And these are all masks. It's really cool, though. But she has no hair and stuff. So um, at one point, and I have it on video. It's really fun. Um, he, you can see these two pictures here. He started like coming towards me and he really liked my hair so he took off my hat that I was wearing and then he started sniffing my hair in this picture and then she's like she, I know the picture's really bad because of the lighting but I still wanted to document that she started touching her head because she's like she wanted my hair for her so I thought it was fun how they interacted with the people and everything and this is a picture of her again and she was super creepy when she was walking because she was like just born and she was learning to walk she was mimicking what he was doing and her walking was so creepy i loved it um so i just wanted to document that and i just added some chipboard stickers from boo and so this is one of the projects that i made for the, my diamond dyes youtube hop and um Halloween series. I created this invitation. I didn't know what to do with it, so I added it into my book to document the hops I was a part of. Like I said, I was part of two hops, and I just wrote about it in here. This is a continuation of the amusement park. We did this haunted house. Um, it's called Maison Rouge. Basically, it's just a clown house, and um, I don't get scared of haunted houses. I actually find them very amusing, but in this house, it was... There was a moment where um, it's a clown house. I don't like clowns, but I've not, I'm not as scared of them as I used to be. So at one point, I was first again. I'm always first in haunted houses. And um, at the end of this little hallway, I see this clown. And I look back because I thought, maybe is, it reflection, is he behind me? Is that a reflection of a mirror? I wasn't sure. So I turned back. I'm like, I got my friend. I'm like, oh my god, he's there. And then he started calling to us with his hand. He was like doing this, you know? my friend was like no that's it I'm going I'm leaving and he heard that she was scared and wanted to go so he went around and he was coming towards us and and she just shoved me she's like go 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 and it was so funny I was literally scared I did not want to do this house I was really scared I didn't want to finish it um I I never I'm never usually scared and this one really scared me which I love because that's the whole point of it I I liked it so it was fun. It props to that clown who terrified the hell out of us. But it was really fun. I loved it. And then so um, this is just a picture of me uh, waiting outside of the house. And it was really cold that day. I even wore my winter jacket. But for some reason I didn't layer up. I was freezing. It was so cold. Oh my gosh. And then this yellow bit here is the bracelet. The wristband that we can use to go into the houses. Because we paid. This was a free house but there's four that you pay for. And uh, we only got to do two of the four because there were so many people. We had to wait in line. And um, I've done this before, but we went early in the morning. And this time we went at night. So that's why there was more people. And then this is just a picture of me with Frankenstein's monster and the little witch. And these um, characters, they do like a show where they sing for the kids. And it's a lot of fun. If you are on my Instagram and you scroll down for two years ago, you'll see the video of them dancing and singing because it's just so cute. Sometimes I love watching it. It's so funny. Alright, so this is an actual card uh, that I just cut down to size because I wanted to kind of create a file folder. So there's a lot of extra stuff inside, more pictures and journaling of the day. This is a picture of the vampire layer. They have like a vampire section and the vampires this year are different. And this is like a demon. So I wrote demons and it reminded me of that scene in Halloween episode of Buffy when she's like, demon, demon. So I was saying that all day pretty much. It was fun. And then this is um, a chainsaw guys, another like scare zone, and I wanted to take a selfie with him. I love that picture, and this one's like pretty awesome. I love how this came out, the blurriness in the background. I That's a really great picture. So I just did some layering, some clusters, wash tape stickers, and stuff like that. If you have any questions about anything I use, just ask me. Again, I use a lot of the After Dark stickers and ephemera. 
my stickers for my Jeepers Creepers kit, washi tapes for Michaels and Walmart, and just papers for my stash. So day 18, um, let's see. It says I made two cards today and started season 10 of Supernatural. I was catching up on the shows that I've missed and not been following up on too well. So um, that's just these two cards I made, a picture of Supernatural season 10, and then um, the date and the sticker. And then um, the 19th was a Monday, and I got into an accident. This was my first car accident. Um, some, some lady rear-ended me, and it was traumatic. I've never been in an accident before. It was really hard. Um, it was kind of really scary. And we still don't even have our car fixed. There was complications. Eventually, they, f they said they would fix our car because they didn't want to. And so the insurance is going to fix the car and we still haven't received it back. That's how serious this accident was. We still don't have the car and there was firemen that came and it was just pretty crazy. Um, and this is a sticker that says keep calm and costume on. But I took out that and I just wrote keep calm and cry because I did a lot of that. Not going to lie. And that's her car and then that's my car. Um, but there's more damage. Like pretty much all of the frame is broken. The, the trunk, the lights. Anyway. So that's that in here. So something wicked this way comes. <laughs> and then in here I have a pocket. Oh, let me show you. Um, that day was also the voting day. Uh, I did end up going going to vote because I was trying to go to be seen by a doctor. Um, I went to three different clinics and stuff. So I didn't end up going to vote. But uh, my friend sent us this picture of Frankenfurter. And this was like something that was going around downtown. And Francis says, uh, it's Halloween, vote Frankie. And it's pretty freaking awesome i want to take it down and put it in my room but when i saw it it was like nailed to the wall so i couldn't get it off i'm really sad about that um i just used a polaroid frame that i got from sabrina ann and look how freaking cute vote frankie hell yeah i'd vote frankie all the time he could be my my whatever prime minister and then here is the journaling day 20 i received my secret reaper swap from melanie this is the card she made me and then inside they're like little um, bits of zombie hands so I did my journaling inside and I just used the date here because I, I, I used the orange because it would have been black on black it wouldn't really show too well so I did my journaling in here and I put a picture of the swap that I received from her and I noticed that the Canon selfie prints really um, blurry photos anyway this is just the back I wanted to use up this card because I have a ton of these this is my life and so I just put it here added some stickers this is a die cut from Small binders, pretty simple. And I'll end the video here just for the sake of making it too long. Thank you so much for watching and I'll have the rest of my pages in the next videos to come. See you guys then. Bye.